So this is a great exercise if you want to practice, if you feel you're a bit rusty with a pen or, uh, or you want to try to bypass your brain a little bit. Get yourself, um, I've got, I'm working on my, my postcards. Uh, I've got loads of postcards printed up. Uh, I recommend you do the same, by the way. Get loads of postcards printed up. You give them out as freebies or you sell them. Uh, I sell packs of these. Or sometimes if people buy uh, uh, larger items off me and stuff like that, or artwork or prints, uh, you get some postcards for free, all that kind of stuff. Uh, and, um, and sometimes I do little illustrations on them, do little... Um, freestyles on them and that's what this is all about really it's about freestyling because you want to be bypassing the brain as much as possible i do work in pencil because i just prefer it but they're very loose sketches as you'll see it's all time lapse stuff so you know you'll have to watch carefully you might have to freeze frame a little bit but i've done um i'm gonna do six back to back and um some in color some in black and white just jam it basically just chuck stuff about and it's just about it's just about trying to get past what my brain is thinking and just have a bit of fun really and um i need to do a few of these sessions to be honest because i've not done letters for quite a long time i do the same letters you know the letters that you can see here and here and you know i run the same letters and it's it, that's fine and everything because i'm generally a character bloke but some um, but i do need to uh, jam letters every so often um because i might be painting letters soon that's the thing about it i might have to paint some soon and you want to be confident you always want to be confident going to the wall i always freestyle on the wall as well i don't work from a sketch so i need to i need to be able to know what my letter forms are by the way that is why we black the book that's why we illustrate so much on paper you want to do lots and lots and lots of work on paper because when it comes to the wall you won't need a sketch I promise you, I haven't worked for a sketch from, oh, I don't even know. I don't even know, 16 years or something since I worked from a sketch. I don't work from sketches. I don't need to because I work so much on the uh, on the paper and in the black book that I just know what I'm doing. So um, I recommend you do the same. So here we go. I'm going to show you this. And um, yeah. See what you think.
So there we go. Um, some are better than others. Uh, some worked out a bit better, but I don't really care. Do you know what I mean? I don't really care. Uh, I'll, I'll do this as giveaways when people buy stuff. Um, they can they can have them with the order, with their orders and all that. Uh, so for me, it, it's just about having a bit of a jam, really. Chucking stuff up in the air. It's it's really good it's just great practice really it's great practice you get technically very good very quick because you're working fast i mean this lot i don't know how long it's taken me 40 minutes or something you know it's quick it's really quick you work quick and you can see that this is an early one the form is not particularly great and the technique is not great last one this form is much much better the lines are much more confident you know that's to do with muscle memory that's to do with technique that's to do with how much i'm doing it you know uh i'm not working with a pen enough at the moment i've got other stuff to do you know trying to balance all kinds of stuff, stuff at the moment but um you know you can see that the first one that i've done here is very traditional form that's the sort of stuff i'm knocking out all the time uh that's that's bound to be where i go that's my safe place you know go to this kind of form and then I start to chuck it around a little bit and start to play with form. That probably didn't really work at all, but who cares? <laughs> no. Like I say, it's all about chucking it out. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that and uh, I'll see you soon.